Hi, I'm Max from Riff Factory. Welcome to the second episode of our new YouTube series Riff Academy. If you haven't seen the first part, now's the time. In this episode, we'll focus on installing the lamps. Our aquarium is not a large tank, so we chose the following set for this aquarium. Two Reef Flare S lamps and a Reef Flare Arm 50. Reef Flare is a smart LED lamp from Reef Factory. One of the most interesting solutions on the market that offers intuitive operation, precise configuration and smart functions. The smaller LEDs provide appropriate chlorine for the animals and optimum conditions for even the most emerging corals. The devices were designed specifically to highlight the natural coral of corals and to provide them with nutrition in the form of high-quality light. The lamps are equipped with one of the market's leaders' LEDs. The color, lenses and pore allow you to grow even the most dimensioned corals. Maximum coverage of the one lamp is 60 by 60 cm. Our aquarium is 90 by 50, so the two lamps are more than enough. Now, let's install the lamp on the arm. After opening the box, we see an insert with a user manual in several languages. It is important that you read the manual before using the device. In addition, we have a lamp, a reset magnet and a European version of the power supply. Each device is also available with a power supply in the UK version. In the box with a hanger, you will find an arm, X handle, screws and an alley key. At the beginning, we need to mount the handle to the arm, tightening it with the longest screw and nut. Then, screw the lamp to the holder with the other four screws. Now our set is ready. Let's go back to aquarium to install it. Remember to, while fixing the lamp on the glass, screw in on the rubber cap so as not to damage your aquarium. Now the lamp is correctly installed. Let's plug it in. Let's move on to operating the device from the application level. As this is the first of our devices in this series, I will show you how to configure them. Firstly, we connect to the device by selecting its Wi-Fi name. Uh, type in the password refactory written together. Now go to reflare.io in the web browser. Configuration will begin. Let's start by choosing a language, then choose the initial lamp settings. We we'll set up our lamps in a 10 hours duty cycle. Later, in the lamp panel, we will set colors. OK, now let's connect to our home Wi-Fi network. The network is connected. Let's link this device to our smart reef account. If you don't have any account, you can create it for free. Congratulations, the device has been connected correctly. Now we can switch back to our Wi-Fi network and operate the device from the Smart Reef app on the phone or in the browser at reeffactory.com. Of course, Reef Flare has many configuration options. We can link our lamp to our tank. Thanks to preset function, we can also save our color settings and share with other aquarists. The current temperature of the lamp is constantly monitored and in the event of possible exceeding of the operating temperature range, it automatically starts the cooling system and informs the user via push or email notification. As you can see, our lamps have a lot to offer. Now when we have the fluted aquarium, the rock ready and the lamps connected, we can move on to the next steps. But that's in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and for feedback of our last episode. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below this video and join our Facebook group, Refactory Family. Follow us on Facebook and Instagram and remember to click subscribe 
so don't miss our new videos. See you soon.